Pretend you're given a handful of coins and you have to find out how much they're worth altogether. Here we'll show you how to count coins and find their total value. Here we have a collection of some coins and we want to find their total value. The first thing we do is sort them into groups of each type of coin. We put the coins of highest value on top and the ones of lowest value on the bottom. We have two quarters, which are worth 25 cents each, one dime, which is worth 10 cents, and one nickel, which is worth 5 cents. Next we'll count up the values to get the total amount. We'll keep track of the total here. We have 25 cents plus 25 cents equals 50 cents plus 10 cents equals 60 cents plus 5 cents equals 65 cents. So the total value of this group of coins is 65 cents. Now we'll take another group of coins and find their total value. First we'll sort them in order of value. We have one loonie, which is worth one dollar, one quarter, which is worth 25 cents, one dime, which is worth 10 cents, and we have two nickels, which are worth five cents each. We'll keep track of the total here. We have one dollar plus 25 cents, which we can write as 0.25 dollars. So, so far we have one dollar and 25 cents plus 10 cents, which we can write as $0.10 dollars, which gives us a total of one dollar and thirty-five cents, plus five cents, or $0.05 dollars, which adds up to one dollar and forty cents. Finally, we have another five cents, or $0.05 dollars, which is now a total of one dollar and forty-five cents. So we can summarize by saying that this group of coins has a total value of one dollar and 45 cents. As you practice this, you'll be able to count up change quite quickly. We have one dollar plus 25 cents, which is 125, plus 10 cents is 135, plus 5 cents is 140, plus 5 cents is 145. 